Meghan Markle has spent her second year in Sandringham for 2018, alongside husband Prince Harry and his family. This is annual tradition for the royal family since renovations on Buckingham Palace meant they were confined to the Norfolk residence. Every family member was present for the day, including new addition Jack Brooksbank and newly titled Meghan as the Duchess of Sussex. One notable absence however was Prince Philip, the Duke of Edinburgh, who has been retired from royal duties since 2017. How did Dory Ragland spend Christmas? Dory Ragland allegedly turned down an invitation from the Queen this year to spend Christmas Day at Sandringham. The invitation would have been unusual for the monarch, who generally does not invite extended family and in-laws to the festivities. Instead, Dory Ragland opted to spend the big day without her pregnant daughter at home in the US. Read more. Did photographer reveal Meghan's due date? Meghan's mother was spotted journeying out onto her drive to collect mail on the day. Stepping out from her Los Angeles home, she could be seen donned in a casual cardigan, loose-fitting trousers and trainers. According to Vanity Fair, she was invited by the Queen to the royal retreat because she was impressed with her conduct at the royal wedding in May. Doria will not be alone for long however, as Meghan and Harry are due to visit the US in January. Such an invitation would however have been a huge departure from tradition for Queen Elizabeth II, who is apparently very strict about ticking to royal blood for the annual Sandringham celebrations. Read more, does this video reveal the real royal feud? Both in-laws and former in-laws who have children in the direct line of succession have often been exempt from invitations. However, Princess Diana was once invited after her divorce from Prince Charles and famously declined the offer. Mother to recently wed Princess Eugenie Sarah Ferguson, the Duchess of York, has not been invited since her divorce to Prince Andrew however. Talking to Town and Country magazine, author and former royal editor Duncan Larkham revealed the royals are entrenched in Christmas tradition. Dot read more, what did the royal family do on Christmas Day? He said, the blood that runs through the royals veins is the blood of tradition. They represent everything that is traditional. And the Queen's Christmas Sandringham gathering has always been for immediate family and immediate family only. For example, Carol and the Michael Middleton have never been invited to join the royals for Christmas at Sandringham.